At Dixon Distributing in Godfrey, Illinois, striving for operational efficiency is a way of life. And as you'll see, this Anheuser-Busch wholesaler is way out front when it comes to their beer delivery strategies and fleet vehicles. The end loader vehicle is Dixon's latest acquisition. And this vehicle is literally changing the way they do business, in the warehouse and on the streets, by allowing the wholesaler to deliver by stop and reduce delivery time. It's much better than we could have ever imagined. It will definitely increase the fleet management and the operational uh, efficiencies of, of any AB wholesaler. Dixon's Vice President and General Manager, Scott Dixon, says with the increasing number of SKUs, the end loader vehicle provides a much more efficient method for his drivers to deliver beer. With the side loader vehicles, they're having to go open five, six doors just for one handcart full of beer. I think uh, the benefits start from the moment he steps out of the truck. When you come up to a stop, you don't have to raise a bunch of doors and pick one case out of this door and two out of this one. He walks back to just one door, opens that door. It's all power assisted as far as getting up into the vehicle. He's not having to climb up. You just go get the cart. It's already loaded and it's got a tag on it. Tells you where it goes. You just wheel it to the end loader, let it down and wheel it in the store. It's much, much easier. At this Craftsman location in St. Charles, Missouri, they equip utility end loader vehicles in accordance with Anheuser-Busch's heavy duty specifications, adding everything from lift gates to the AB decals on the sides of the vehicles. Most wholesalers that say that they're happy with their side loaders really need to look at the operational efficiencies uh, that an end loader actually will bring. Scott Dixon knew that purchasing three new end loaders would be a major investment. He wanted quality and something that would last. We made a conscious decision that we were going to get a good system. We weren't going to worry about a couple hundred dollars when you're investing um, in a new vehicle, which as everyone knows is not cheap. The design of the end loader provides new delivery options for wholesalers. Options that allow loading by stop, while at the same time reducing the physical wear and tear on the driver. One of the key components of an end loader is its lift gate. AB recommended lift gate is Maxon BMR column gate. It offers safety for their drivers. It's available in an aluminum platform and a steel platform. Aluminum platform actually reduces the weight of the lift gate by 550 pounds. And what that means to a wholesaler is a lighter trailer means more product delivered to your customer. The 16-inch aluminum retention ramp keeps your driver and your product safe on the platform. It also offers you the flexibility and versatility to haul all kinds of products, a pallet, carts, or hand trucks. So Scott, it's been about six months since you've in-serviced your end loaders. How are they working out for you? Working out pretty well. We're very pleased with the decision to invest in them. The, the drivers, after their first uh, few weeks of initial skepticism, which uh, you always get that, I think now if you ask every, every one of them that uses it, they would, they would not go back to the old system. I like them. I like them a lot. I mean, they're, uh, to me, they save a lot of wear and tear on the body, and it's so much easier you know, than having to step, in, step up and step down off your truck or pull beer off your, uh, off your side loader. It's easier on the driver. Uh, the entire body, the back, the legs, the knees, the shoulders, everything. The whole process is much easier on the driver, much more driver friendly. With the end loader, there are no bays to open, just one door. The orders are already put together on carts or pallets, so there's fewer trips into an account, taking up less time at retail. There is more time spent in the warehouse getting the loads together because you're you're putting your loads together by stop instead of just tallying up the total cases you need and throwing them on the truck. We can cut delivery time down a lot. Uh, we uh, usually with the hand carts, we take maybe six cases at a time. With the uh, cart system, we can take 25 at a time. So with two of us, instead of taking 12 at a time, we can take 50, 50 cases down there one, on one trip. So it cuts down time tremendously. You're not spending as much time opening the bays on the trucks. You know, we can get 25 cases at a time as opposed to six on a wheeler or 10. 
on bottles, and that saves a lot of time and a lot of trips, a lot of different, you know, back and forths in a cooler. Saves you a lot of time, a lot of trips. Besides the standard features the end loader has to offer, there are options that a wholesaler can add to reduce maintenance expense and downtime. For example, a Maxon dual pump system. If your driver is delivering product and the liftgate pump motor goes out, he simply comes over, opens the box, flips the toggle switch, and he has alternative power, reducing your downtime from hours to minutes. Another option might be the automatic tire inflation system. The way the system operates is as long as the tractor is connected to the trailer, your tires are running at optimal tire pressure. The number one failure for tires is improper inflation. It's estimated that it would save 30% on your annual tire cost and increase fuel economy. In addition to ensuring correct tire pressure, an air ride suspension system provides a level ride. Back of the trailer, uh, it won't move until it's all leveled. And it also it has all the tire pressures equal. And once everything's adjusted, it'll release the brakes and then it allows you to move. Because sometimes I have more beer on one side of my truck than the other, and it'll automatically just level the truck up. And it's really a neat, neat deal. And here are some additional options to consider. A stainless steel rear case and rear ICC bumper, all aluminum hinged doors, driver friendly, they weigh about 35 pounds less than the, a normal door. Never need painting. Surface mounted scuff liner. This allows the product to stay off of the wall. There's also a quarter inch by 24 inch steel bank plate that's surface mounted on the front wall. A 27 inch recessed threshold plate. This is a very high impact area and that is essential to increasing the life of that vehicle. There are three other specifications that will add to the integrity of the end loader. 8-inch cross members, full length of the trailer, 16-inch side post, full length of the trailer, upper coupler plate and approach plate at 516 inch steel. Scott Dixon decided to purchase nearly all the options on the end loader. For him, it's all about optimal efficiency and better fleet management. Initially, I know we talked about a, a lot of different specifications. Uh, which ones are you glad that you chose? Well, um, we're pleased that we got an adequately sized plate, gives the drivers plenty of maneuvering room um, to, to get whether it's a cart or a pallet on here. Um, we're very pleased with, with the plate that we, we had spec'd on here, the stainless right. steel plate. Another thing that we like is the chem light roof. Um, that's been a great option. It allows a lot of light in. Um, the, the one thing that we would have added uh, with that system, we would have put in the vent system, which we have added since. But um, it, it's helped to keep it a little cooler. So if you were to add any additional end loaders, is there any options that you would add to it? Well, the main thing that we would add, I think, is the power down feature. Um, the, the plates sometimes go down slowly when it's very cold out. We're kind of in a borderline climate area. But um, that would certainly be something we would add. So let's review. What are the main benefits and features of the end loader trailer? It's easier on the driver, uh, the entire body, the back, the legs, the knees, the shoulders, the whole process is much easier on the driver, much more driver friendly. There's definitely a shortened delivery time at each stop. Um, a truck does you no good if it's sitting in the warehouse not being able to be used or at the repair shop. Uh, we wanted a truck that's on the road every day. We went with the, the Cadillac because we know it'll pay off long term. Scott Dixon definitely realizes the importance of fleet management. He says the end loader system has already improved his company's operational effectiveness. With the additional SKUs that we've gotten over the years, there's much more efficiency and I think it'll get even more so in the future because there's certainly more new brands and, and packages on the horizon. So uh, end loaders work? End loaders work and I think they're going to be even a bigger benefit in the future. We're very pleased.